Hey guys, I wanted to do a quick video on how to check the phase of your crank on your XLT triple motor. Before I get into that, I just want to say thanks for everybody checking out my channel, watching my videos. If you like what you see, click the subscribe button. And if you want to be notified when I upload videos, just click the little bell to the right of the subscribe button. And uh, we also got some merch up on Teespring. I'll post the, uh, the link to the sweatshirts, t-shirts, tank tops, long sleeves. Um, I got hoodies and crew necks. So uh, check it out. There's some stickers on there as well. If you guys wanted to look at that, um, go for it. And uh, if you like what you see in this video, just give me the thumbs up button. All right, so if you want to check the phase of your crank, it's very easy. Uh, you just need a set of calipers. Um, don't have to be digital like these, but um, your motor doesn't have to be out of the sled. It's easier just because I know this one's junk for demonstration that it's out and I just slipped a clutch on here so I can spin the crank uh, need as I need. So I try to set the camera up so you guys can see what I'm doing and I can still see what I'm doing. So we'll get at it. So with what you're gonna wanna start out is finding top dead center of any cylinder uh, and then we can work from there. So with how these XLTs work, you can have one cylinder at top dead center and the other two should be dead even. So how we're gonna find that is I'm gonna set my calipers up, stick this down in the, the hole till it's at the piston. So when you know you're close, this says 2.23. I try to do it right from the center of the piston. Once you find where it stops, the other cylinder should be the same exact height. Okay, 3.163. As you can see, caliper doesn't go to the same height. So 1.63 to 1.07 or 0.107 versus 0.163. We come out with 56 thousandths. I just wanted to say thanks for watching my videos, checking out my channel um, and all my other social media outlets. I appreciate you guys checking it out. And uh, I ask if you like what you see, click the subscribe button. If you wanna be notified when I upload videos, click the bell to the right of the subscribe button. Um, also, you could, you'd be helping me out if you hit the like button, the thumbs up down below the video. Uh, that helps get my videos seen more and hits a greater audience. So. so here's my sportsman sled. Currently the crank is bent on it and uh, Motor's gonna have to come out of that. This is my mod sled. And uh, the crank's gotta come out of that. This is a sled I bought in Canada that I gotta put together. I plan on uh, finishing it and hopefully selling it as a complete ready to go sled. This is my dad's. <clears throat> it's slow, because I've beaten it. So I'm slow. But yeah, I mean, we got a whole lot of garbage in here right now. Not a freaking slut will turn a lap. Did you just look at this shit? They got 99 problems, but running laps ain't one because they're fucking junk, man.